hello good evening once again everyone the daily dose here and in today's video i'm gonna give you a dose of what's new from mini gt we got tarmac works we got tamika and of course we've got some green lights so some good news to collectors out there and some great cars coming soon from these uh, brands so first up here is from tarmac works this is actually a collaboration between the uh, gr garage and tarmac works they call this the cinderella rwb porsche and check this one out man this is a great looking car and and like all tarmac works cars this is also based on a real life rwb porsche and this looks just insane insane details insane quality and again all tarmac works cars are excellent out of all tarmac works cars i have not seen that i don't like even their uh, unloved cars yeah you know they're unloved because when sale happens they're down up to 70 percent off but these cars are also uh, well built and well detailed so that this one here just an awesome looking car and next up here we've got a hobby 64 amg gtr safety car man again check out the details on the uh car here yeah really looking good here's the rear view of the car and again check out the details these cars from hobby 64 some uh, roll a little bit some don't roll at all and then they're i mean uh, they're meant to be uh, static display pieces so check out the details again always love the uh, tail lights and the headlights on these cars and of course the details and also this one comes with rubber tires like all of their cars next up here we've got a porsche 911 gtr we featured this one in a couple of videos ago but this time right now check out the uh picture here's new picture this one actually has great details i uh, told you in my last video that i really don't like this car out of the four cars that we've shown but this this time Man, really loving that one. And another one here. This is the pink pig container. So this will be out soon. This is from Samak Works again. So RWB container here. They call this the pink pig container. Next up, we've got some Tarmac Works Hyundai i30 and TCR. So this was used on the uh, WTCR race of Macau back in 2018 and again these cars are meant to be displayed it comes with this great packaging with the acrylic uh, case and base and this one here looking lovely as well damn next up some uh, limited I mean Tamika limited vintage neo cars or TLVNs for short so this is their Mazda Savannah RX-7 they have uh, two colors actually so this is their silver or gray one so great details as well I just wish the headlights would pop up like uh, because yeah this, these are expensive cars these are expensive I mean scale cars for from uh, T uh, Tamika so I just wish they made this one with pop-up headlights and here's the other color so this is in blue same rims though only the difference again is the paint job so details here no details though on the plate holder which is uh, actually a bad thing so some more picture of the uh, gray Savannah RX-7 so here's the back uh, picture you can see the this one has uh, clear plastic I mean plastic inserts on the tail lights 
so I like that they uh, made the uh, windows clear here so you can see uh, the inside of the car and ooh, this one is a right-hand drive car so here's the blue one same as the silver one so some more Tommy Tech or uh, cars from Tomica here this is it's their uh, TLVN Ferrari 365 GT4 BB so this one comes in blue and black colors and the uh, TLVN Neo Ferrari 512BB comes uh, in red and black yeah, so great cars here oh yeah man check out the details I'm really speechless so apparently you can uh, move the engine cover so you, you can see some more uh, details on the engine here wow wow and this one too comes with rubber tires so look at the interior here love the color of the interior comes with side mirrors too so fantastic set here some more TLVNs we have a Nissan GTR 50th anniversary in blue and a Nissan 50th anniversary in silver here so again great cars again they are really expensive so in here they cost uh, more than a thousand pesos so I know in Japan they cost less but I hope you guys out there in the US will have this uh, available in store soon well actually for us here uh, we don't have this in stores some of us or most of us order online so uh, to be able to have our ha hands on these beautiful TLVNs so hopefully for us guys they will be available in stores so I know in Singapore and uh, Malay oh no yeah, Singapore and Japan they have lots of these cars available in stores next up here we've got some Tomica 50th anniversary cars this is the 2006 Faraday DZ432 oh this one comes with opening doors and this this uh, this car here reminds me of some old Tomica cars so old Tomica cars are made in Japan or China so the uh, Jap uh, Japanese made Tomica cars are probably the oldest ones in the these castings here and they remind me of the old Tomicas here the yeah. opening doors love the interior so that they use the basic rims next up here we have the uh, Toyota 2000 GT this one is in blue again opening doors I have this uh, specific car from Tomica it was made in Japan it was yellow with I think green racing stripes I really don't know uh, from what uh, set it was because I got it at a thrift, thrift shop but anyways look, good looking car here's their police car here this is a Toyota Crown Patrol car man I love the interior here just vintage looking interior really, really looks good next we have a Toyota Crown Super Deluxe so this is in white really clean looking car so this one apparently has same the same interior as the Toyota Crown you can see right there yeah opening doors as well so I don't know why I got some uh, criticism against Tomica their uh, recent uh, mainline cars don't have opening features I mean, in the past I mean, just last year a couple of years ago a lot of their uh, main lines have opening features but now it's gone with the uh, what we got here with the CRV then BMW i8 uh, what, uh, we got a Mazda no opening no opening parts uh, for all those cars I mean Toyota Supra next up here we've got the Corona Mark II hard top so this one has the same interior design or style as the crown and the uh, Crown Patrol so I love the details on the headlights here yeah it is not chrome I think this this is just painted uh, glossy silver and next we've got oh this one is 
is actually a great looking car here. Bluebird SSS -S -S Coupe. Man, I love red cars. This one really looks uh, really looks awesome. And with the de uh, details here. So opening doors as well. So oh this one is scaled at 160. Next We've got some M2 machines. We got some Miho exclusive cars. We Miho exclusive sets. I mean, so we've got a Chevy pickup with a Chevy hauler here. So this is a Super Chase limited production worldwide, limited to 350 pieces only. So the Super Chase here has uh, the gold accents. Well, the regular version doesn't have it and the tires are black I mean the rims are black so here it is on the card Chevy C60 truck and the Chevy Silverado next up here this is limited production worldwide oh only 3,000 pieces will be made this is the Chevy C60 truck man this actually looks good Next, this is the Super Chase version. This is limited to only 250 pieces worldwide. Wow, check that one out. Awesome. Next, here we've got some Chevy Silverado 3500 HD and the heavy duty trailer. Yeah, so apparently you can connect both of these. And this will be awesome here. I can put any car right there. So this will really fit because this is 164 scale. Not really quite familiar with green lights. I don't know if their 164 scale is real. 164 scale or is it a little bit bigger or a little bit smaller to other 164 scale cars. But anyways. The cars here look awesome. Next, we've got the Ford F350 Lariat with gooseneck trailer. Yeah. This one looks better actually compared to the uh, Chevy Silverado. Looks great. Next, we've got the Dodge Ram 3500 with the gooseneck trailer so here's the carded set here this is part of the hitch and tow series limited to how many 2438 all white next oh limited production 3000 pieces worldwide we've got moon eyes here 1953 VW Beetle Deluxe USA model and trailer. So Moon Eyes leave a livery for both of these uh, uh, units here inside. We got the Beetle. I just wish uh, instead of mostly black here, they painted this one mostly yellow and the Moon Eyes black. The trailer here looks awesome as well. Same rims on the uh, beetle and the trailer next we've got Maui and Sons we've got 1959 VW Microbus Deluxe USA model and trailer with the Maui and Sons tampo here on the side so I remember Maui and Sons I think was quite popular here uh, back in the 90s I used to see a lot of their um, a lot of t-shirts with Maui and Sons printing but apparently I haven't seen uh, Maui and Sons here anymore but yeah it's good to see them uh, with the uh, I mean on the VW bus deluxe and trailer set here so this is limited to 3,000 pieces worldwide as well next we've got the 1959 VW double uh, double cab camper and the trailer man this actually looks the best so far man I love this one here I love it love the orange and white 
trailer as well and Ooh. love the uh, camper here man this is awesome next we've got some oh this is on pre-order right now at hobby, hobby stock so these are uh, mini gts we've got the nine, uh, 164 scale mercedes-benz actros with the 50 foot container so and we've got a dry container here with the evergreen uh, logo and a plain white dry container and then a plain blue 40 inch dry container all 164 scale again pre-order at hobby stock right now next up here this is from tarmac works and this is actually an exclusive car this is their web store special edition so for Tarmac Works members, uh, the members can get a maximum of three units, and non-members only two units. So yeah, check out the details on the car. Again, RWB Porsche. Hype is real. They have released a lot of RWB Porsche right now. I hope they don't oversaturate the market. Because if they do and this, uh, the demand uh, dies down, the prices of these cars will really go down. But no problem for collectors. But if the prices go down, we will enjoy it better. <laughs> so next car is here. So this lucky dude, uh, diecast GR, found this right now. So they are now available at I forgot to, from what from where he is I just uh, put it on this part of the video but anyways got this set here new set for major red and yeah, we got a Ford Mustang here's a what's this a Camaro looking good man I love this this uh, Camaro here with the flames and looks like a devil here right this looks actually fantastic next we got Subaru WRX STI and we got the Mercedes AMG GTR with the red interior so uh, out of the four here I love this one here and next we got some tarmac works we got the Koenigsegg, Koenigsegg Ajira prototype so again we feature this one in a previous video but the image was not that nice so here's a better one and yeah this one has lovely details just loving it oh yeah really looking awesome and apparently you can remove the engine cover here exposing the details and uh, exposing the engine right there so great great Kind of like Ajara from Tarmac Works. So that is all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this one, and I hope you enjoyed the beautiful cars from Mini GT, Tarmac Works, and Tomica. And yeah, thank you to these wonderful people here for the pictures and for the updates. We got Mini GT at their Facebook page, Tarmac Works at also their Facebook page. We got Diecast GR. Uh, Tomica at their Facebook page and Mew Exclusive uh, at their Instagram page and also Tomac Works Instagram. So if you uh, have Instagram accounts or social media accounts, please do follow them on their social media pages. So that is all once again. I hope you enjoyed this one. And if you did, please smash the like button, subscribe if you haven't yet. And stay tuned for more. Bye-bye. Peace out and enjoy the rest of the day.